Tater tots are ready. What's up, Warriors? Arcade Warrior here. I hope you're having a great day so far. Um, today, I'm going to be bringing you guys another fan mail video. This is Warrior Fan Mail, episode number six. I got a bunch of letters, and I even got a padded envelope over here to open up. So here is the first letter that I'm going to open up. I got my letter opener already, and we're going to attempt this. Here we go. Oh, I ripped it open. Uh, whatever. Um, I'm going to stuff my glasses and my shirts. Here we go. I, I totally butchered the envelope with the letter opener. Um, but, uh, I believe we got either a letter or a drawing in here. I'm not exactly, ooh. Yes, we got a drawing. So this is the thing that I got from the butchered envelope that I just butchered. Uh, here we go, let's open this up. And let's see what it says. Can't even open it up. Dear Arcade Warrior, Tater Tots are ready. Crap, I think I spelled it wrong. But, uh, please send a signed Arcade Warrior card. Love your bids. And there is a drawing of an epic claw machine down over here. Look at this drawing right over here. It says Epic Claw Machine, and you got a claw machine. It's filled with money. You got an Xbox One in there, a PlayStation 4, an MP3 player. That is awesome, dude. Thank you so much for the letter and the drawing. I will definitely send you back a signed Arcade Warrior card. Let's get started on this envelope from Ryan Fitz. Uh, let me grab my letter opener, and let's slice this down the middle. Maybe I could actually open this without... Oh, we did it. Oh, hold on. Poked a hole through it! I poked a hole through it! So here's the letter that I got from Ryan. Dear Arcade Warrior, I'm such a huge fan of you. I even named a Cardboard Slam winner after you. I enjoy watching you play arcade games like Claw Machines, Coin Pusher, and my favorite, Slam Winner. I am 11 and you taught me how to love arcades. I hope we could do a meet and greet at an arcade. If not, that's okay. Just please send me something back. Your number one fan, Ryan Fitz. P.S. I was thinking when you're done with school, you should open up your own arcade. Hashtag Tater Tots are ready. I've never heard of someone making a cardboard slam winner machine, dude. That is awesome, Ryan. I'm glad that you love the videos, Ryan, and meet and greets. Um, I would love to do scheduled meet and greets one day. I've never done like a legit meet and greet. I've just like ran, like my viewers have ran into me at the arcade, so I've never done like an actual scheduled meet and greet. Um, I did do um, an arcade video with one of my friends, Arcade Rebel, but I never like did an actual like, but yeah, I've never done like a meet and greet where I scheduled it and a lot of my viewers like showed up and stuff like that. I've just like, they've just ran into me when I've been like filming and stuff at the arcade or when I'm in a store or something like that. So yeah, I've never done a scheduled meet and greet, but my viewers have ran into me like at the arcade or in a store or something like that. And, um, but I would love to do that in the future, like schedule an actual meet and greet at an arcade or someplace like that. I think that'd be really cool. Let's check out Ryan's drawings now right over here. Ooh, Arcade Warrior Drawings, that's what it's titled. Here's the first drawing over here, guys. Look at that, that is me with my Arcade Warrior shirt on and I'm playing the big one, Claw Machine. Look at this one over here. This is me right over here. I got a thousand tickets on the Elvis Coin Pusher. That's actually my favorite coin pusher, guys, the Elvis Coin Pusher. Um, we got Tater Toss already over here. The slogan, that's awesome. This is awesome, guys. And I believe that this machine says there's a jackpot of 539 tickets. Thank you so much, Ryan, for the letter and the drawings, and I will definitely send you back a signed Arcade Warrior card. We got something from France over here. It says, by airmail, par avion, royal mail. I believe this is from France, um, par avion. I think that's something, I took French, but I honestly don't know. I like got 30 on my final exam. I really don't know. Um, but here we go, I just ripped this open with my hands because I, I don't know, there's like no, like, oh, there was a top. Whatever, I, I opened it from the side. I just teared this baby open from the side, so let's check to see what we got in here. Ooh, nice. Dang. Okay. We got everything out of here. This is what we got. Um, the first thing that fell out was gummies. So this is what I got from the envelope um, from France. I believe it's from France. I'm not sure. It says Par Avion. I think that's French. Maybe not. I got gummies. Yes. Haribo. Haribo gummies. I, I can never pronounce this. They have these here in America. Haribo gummies. But I never know how to pronounce it. Haribo gummies. And this is a horror mix. Hario. 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 Harbo, Hariobo. I sound like an idiot trying to say that word. But we got a letter over here. It says number one YouTuber Arcade Warrior. So let's check it out. Yeah, number one YouTuber Arcade Warrior. I don't think I'm the number one YouTuber, you know. If you guys, if I'm your favorite, that's awesome. I don't know how. I'm kind of lame, but I, I am kind of, I am pretty lame. But we're going to put the gummies off the side and check to see what we got in here. And there's a drawing right in the front. We got a drawing right on the front over here that says Arcade Warrior with the sword, the fire sword. Look at that, guys. It says right down there to fire sword. That is awesome. And on the back, it says 
Awesome. Look, oh, let it focus. There we go. Look at these symbols. I used to draw these in my no, um, freaking English notebook in seventh grade. I forgot what they were called, but I still know how to do them. Awesome smiley. Let's check out the letter that we got over here now. The one that says number one YouTuber on it. Hello, Arcade Warrior. My name is Charles, and I am from England. I totally screwed that up. I, I saw airmail and it said par avion, and I felt that was a French word, so I said it was from France, which it's from England. So, Charles from England. Awesome. Nice to meet you, Charles from England. I'm sorry that I said France. I saw par avion on the freaking um, envelope, and I thought it was, I, I feel like that's a French word. I don't know why. But let's continue on to the letter. I want to say you are one great YouTuber and you have really inspired me to go to the arcade and I just want to say thank you. I also have a few questions. When did you first go to the arcade? What is your favorite candy? Do you have a girlfriend? The first time I went to an arcade, I think I was either 4 or 5 and that was, I'm pretty sure, Chuck E. Cheese. Chuck E. Cheese is like the Dave and Buster's for kids. It's like for like ages 1 to like 8, I don't know. I, I, went, I went to Chuck E. Cheese until I was 12 so I was over the age limit. Yeah, I stopped going to Chuck E. Cheese when I was 12. It was it got kind of embarrassing because not that like I was old or anything, but I got really tall and the, all the little kids there were like three-year-old midgets and stuff, so I, I don't know. So Chuck E. Cheese was the first arcade I went to most likely. It's really fun. The skee-ball machines are... I, the pizza is amazing, even though it's like frozen or whatever. It's delicious though. The next question over here is, what's your favorite candy? I'd probably have to go with Smarties for like sugar candy, and for chocolate I would go with Take 5 bars. And the last question, do you have a girlfriend? I'm single, ladies. That is the answer for the last question, Charles. Let's continue your letter over here. Could you also sign a card for me? Here is my address. Yes, I see the uh, address at the top of this uh, letter over here. I will send you a card back, dude, signed. And this is also from Charles. At the moment, I have 7,000 tickets, but I do not know what to trade them for. You are a really cool YouTuber. Keep up the good work. If you could write back or put this in a fan mail video, that would be amazing. I and I have a very annoying bro named Edward, so if you could give a shout out to him, he would love it. Thanks. Yours sincerely, Charles. So shout out to Edward, who happens to be Charles' annoying brother. And by the way, all brothers are annoying, so that shouldn't be offensive to anybody because my brother's annoying. Jason, you're annoying. He's downstairs playing video games, so he couldn't hear me. Okay, I think I got rid of the glare now. There was a terrible glare that was shining on my camera. Oh, hold on. I can't see myself. Hopefully that fixed the glare on my camera over here because there was a glare that was coming in from the stupid... Stupid! You're a stupid son! I'm just kidding, the son's not stupid. Anyway, thank you so much, Charles, for the letter, the drawing, and of course, the gummies that I'm gonna consume later. Next letter over here, this one is from Kitty Cat Meows 94 Let's open up. We're gonna attempt the letter opener. I seriously suck at this thing, I don't know why. I'm, I'm pretty good with, like, knives and stuff, but it just, it doesn't work for me, man. Oh, and, uh, the tape got, uh, so, uh, pfft, pfft, pfft. Tape got stuck on the letter opener. Oh, I'm so immature. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is awesome. I just seen a drawing in here real quick and I'm like mind blown. This is awesome. So let's uh, put the envelope on the floor and let's check this out. We got a bunch. Oh my god, there's so many things in here. Look at this, guys. This is insane. That's me right over here with my spiky hair on my Arcade Warrior pin. I got my Arcade Warrior pin on right now that, you know, I got sent in the last fan mail. But my hair is not too spiky because I got a haircut like two days ago. So it needs to grow out to get longer so I can spike it up like that. But look at that epic claw. Look at all the stuff in here. I'm saying yay. And look at all the freaking... This, this is so artistic. Look, the claw is even grabbing a sword. So that was the first of many. There was four other little things over here. Um, I'm gonna read the notes over here. Um, okay. Hi, it's Kitty Cat Meow 94 You are awesome and I love your videos. I am a huge fan. You probably hear that a lot, but I really am. I have been watching your videos for one year. Can you send me an autograph or stuff you with your signature? You inspire me to start playing the claw machine, and I am a girl, age of 12. Every time you upload a video, I watch. My address with a heart. I, I like, keep staying awesome with a heart, and my address with a heart. I will send you back something awesome with a heart, uh, kitty cat. Well, maybe not with a heart, but I'll, I'll put my heart and thought into it. Kitty cat meows 94. And we also got three other things over here that she made. Like this thing, it's a claw grabbing, I think that's a cheetah. A ze not a zebra, I almost said zebra. That's a claw grabbing a plushie. I think, I don't know my animals well, okay guys? Like, the, I don't know my animals well, but I think that's either, I think it's a cat actually. I called it a zebra. Yeah, and that's stupid. Yes, I believe that is a spotted kitty cat. The claw is grabbing it. We also got this one of me, um, kitty cat, 94. She wrote that down there. That's me with my spiky hair. I got a teddy bear on my shirt. That's awesome. We also got 
um, a heart that says the claw right over there. And we got Arcade Warriors. This is Arcade Warriors with the Arcade Warrior sword. Thank you so much, Kitty Cat Meows94, for the mail, especially the drawings. I just love the way you did my hair. That's perfect. You did my hair perfectly. Look at that. That's just awesome. I'm going to open up this padded envelope next. This one is from Kyle Snyder. Um, by the way, the camera's like changing like angles in the room because I have to... I'm moving it because the sun is like shining in the lens and it's like blurring like the screen and like have... I don't know. Just like blurring the screen, so... The sun's nice. It brightens the room, but I hate when it shines in my camera lens. So let's open this up. This one's from Kyle. Um, I'm, I'm not sure if I need my envelope opener for this, but... There's like a little lip on the back, so... Let's see if I could just like rip it up. Like, this should work. Here we go. Oh, boy. The stupid sun. I'm trying to read. I'm trying to see the stuff I got from Kyle, but the sun is... Jeez. Jesus. God. Is this is this better? Okay, that looks, that looks better, baby. Ah, the sun is in my eyes. Okay, well, yeah, I had to change the angle again. So this is what I got from Kyle over here. The first thing is this little heavy... I dropped it. The first thing over here is this little book. Um, it says the Book of Mormon, another testament of Jesus Christ. JC, um, this is I. This is from Jesus over here. Not this is from Kyle, but it says Jesus on it. Jesus Christ, um, the Church of Jesus Christ. Oh, cool. Thank you, dude. Um, we got a letter over here. Dear our Key Warrior, thanks for yet another year of entertaining me on YouTube. I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. May you continue to win a lot of jackpots and prizes in claw machines. Your subscriber, Kyle Snyder, aka Eclipton. I'm I magically just moved. Yes. Um, but Kyle also sent me a GameStop gift card for ten dollars. Thank you so much, bro. I will definitely use that. Thank you so much for the mail, Kyle. I'm glad to hear that you've been a subscriber for over a year. I guess I've done a good job of entertaining you if you stayed subscribed for that long. Um, also, Merry Christmas to you and a Happy New Year. Thank you for everything that you sent me, the card, the book, and the letter. Thank you so much, and let's move on to the next piece of mail, guys. So we got another letter over here. This one is from Canada. Let's check it out. Perfect letter opened with the letter opener. Master, I, I sometimes, I'm not sure, maybe it just depends on the letter. Sometimes I can open up them easily, and sometimes I struggle. But let's check to see what we got in this. Oh, look at this. Hey, Arcade Warrior, this is my third time writing to you. My name is Evan, and I'm 10 years old. Please write back to me. Thanks, Mr. Miner. The sun is coming in once again. Freaking, ah. Mr. Miner, that name definitely rings a bell. I've received so many letters from you, bro. Um, I would like to write you back, but I don't have your address. There's no address on the envelope up here. It's just two stamps. Um, so please private message me like on YouTube your address or something if you want me to send you back a letter or a sign card, whatever you want. But um, since I don't have um, your address or anything on here, make sure to give that to me. But thank you so much, dude. This is the third letter you sent me, so thank you so much for that, and I'm glad that you enjoy the videos. Keep watching. So, um, so yeah, if you want me to send you back a letter or a card, just make sure to send me like your address, private message me on YouTube or send me an email or something like that, because I don't have your address over here, and I can't send you back a letter. If you don't give me your address, um, all I got up in the left-hand corner is two really cute Canadian stamps that have uh, otters on them. So, yeah, if you want me to send you something back, bro, just make sure to give me your address somehow. Next piece of mail over here. This one is from... Portland, Oregon. This is awesome, guys. This is like a letter mixed with a bunch of drawings. So let's get started. Let's read this. Hey, Arcade Warrior. I am a big fan and proud to be a subscriber. I think your vids are epic and fun to watch. I even use your techniques on games. Unfortunately, there is no Dave & Buster's where I live, but I'm not giving up on finding one. P.S. You are really awesome. Adam. This is from Adam. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate that. And you drew so many awesome drawings. Yeah, that's perfect. Now there's no sunlight in the room because I damned the freaking sun. And now there's clouds blocking it. But whatever. Um, thank you so much, Adam. I appreciate your letter. Um, good luck on finding a Dave and Buster's. It might not be that close to you because, like, my, for example, my Dave and Buster's is, like, an hour away from me. So, you know, your Dave and Buster's might not be, like, right around the block. You might have to travel a little bit because they're not, like, a McDonald's. Like, McDonald's is everywhere. You know, if you know what I mean, like, so, so yeah, just research, so yeah, just research online, like, you know, where your closest Dave and Buster's is to you, it might be like, you know, an hour or even two hours away, be, like, my Dave and Buster's is like an hour or ten minutes away from me, um, so, yeah, they're not always gonna be too close to you. Anyways, let's check out some of the drawings that Adam drew over here. We got one that says Arcade Warrior right up here, the Arcade Warrior logo, that is awesome, thank you so much, dude. Tater tots are ready, right over here you got a Pac-Man that says yum, and the, uh, Pac-Man is actually eating the tater tots. 
There's a picture of me winning something from the big one over here. That's me right over there, a little stick figure dude. That's pretty cool. This is the best drawing on the page right over here. Your swag shades, look at that. Those are my shades right over here. I actually got them on my neck. Yes, awesome. I'm so, I'm so awesome and oh, it says awesome on the back. Look at that. You are really, and then you got awesome and giant text over here. This awesome drawing right over here is so awesome. And there's also a slam a winner machine right down there. Thank you so much, Adam, for the letter and the drawings. And I'm going to put on my shades right now just for you. And I'm going to grab the next piece of mail over here. Uh, we got two letters left. Let's open up this one. This is from Gunner. Disgusting that. I should have never told the sun to go take a walk because now it's hiding behind the clouds. It's upset. We're going to open up this letter. Hopefully I won't cut off my fingers. Yes, we got a sucko. I always do that. I don't know why. It's so so stupid. Uh, where? Oh, it fell on the floor. Here's the thing that was inside. It fell. On, it like slipped right out when I. I don't know what I just did. This is from Gunner over here. Let's check this out, guys. Looks like we got a drawing slash letter. So before I read the letter, I'm gonna show you guys the drawing over here. We have Arcade Warrior. We got a little Pac-Man ghost, a sword, and a claw, and another Pac-Man ghost. Look at this amazing drawing, guys. Look at this drawing right over here, guys. You got Arcade Warrior written in text up here. You got a sword in the middle. You got a claw over here. You got a red Pac-Man ghost over here. And you got a blue one down here. This is the letter from Gunner, guys. Hi, Arcade Warrior. Gunner here with another letter. First, I wanted to talk about how I loved your Halloween claw machine video. That was really cool. And I was wondering if maybe you could do a Christmas video. I hope you had a very good Halloween. And by the way, before I go, I was wondering if you could leave a link to my YouTube channel. I would really enjoy that. I would really want my channel to spread. Um, but anyways, thank you and keep up the good work. P.S. My YouTube channel is Gunnar Roberts and it's the one that says Crazy Dog and has eight subs. I'm glad that you enjoyed the Halloween video, Gunner. Um, I think that was probably one of the coolest videos I've ever done on my machine, and Halloween's like my favorite holiday. So I thought that was really nice. I tried to like deck it out. Like I really put a lot of effort into it. I even like had spider webs um, covering my machine. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool. I'm glad that you enjoyed that video, dude. Gunner also wants me to put the link to his channel in the description of this video. I normally don't do that, guys. Like you know, I do give shout. Like if you ask for a shout out in fan mail, like in letter or whatever, I'll give you a shout out. So I normally like don't put like the link in the description, like for your channel. But I'm gonna give um, Gunner a shout out, and I'm gonna put a link to um, his channel in the description of this video, just because he sent me so many letters. Like I've received so many letters from Gunner. Thank you so much, dude. So I will definitely do that for you, Gunner, just because you have sent so many letters to me. I really appreciate that, dude. So everybody, go check out Gunner's channel. Go subscribe um, to his YouTube channel. His link will be in the description of this video. Thank you so much for the letter, Gunner, and let's move on to the last letter over here. Let's open up this one. This one is from Dallas, Texas. Nice. Perfect open. Awesome. Let's see what we got in here. We got three little notes over here. Uh, they're labeled open first, open last, and open third. So uh, let's let's do this. Open first. We're gonna open up this one first because that's what it says. Here we go. Dear Arcade Warrior, my name is Ethan and I'm 11 years old. And if this is on a fan mail video, can you say sub to Arcade Warrior? Sub to Arcade Warrior. <laughs> also, can you give me a shout out, please? And you gave me a lot of tips. Thank you so much. YouTube name, Gamerscope, and Bobby Smith MLG. I will definitely give you a shout out, dude. Um, go check out his channel, guys. Gamerscope. Um, I just put text right over here, right, right, right here. There it is. Yes, hold it. Hold, oh, okay. Yeah, that's the channel right there, guys. And Bobby Smith MLG. Awesome. Ethan also has some questions down here. Um, I'm going to answer them right now. Can you sign a card, please? Yes, I will sign a card and send it back to you, bro. If you could, shout out. Yes, I already gave you a shout out. And the last question is, and you should make a game of a claw machine. I, I would love to do that, even though I don't have the brains, nor the software to create my own video game. So I guess I'm going to open up the third one first, because it's not the last one. It makes sense. So here we go, let's check this out. Get oh, look at this drawing. This one over here is especially awesome. Look, that's me right over here, winning from the claw machine. Look at my slick hair, that is just awesome. And I'm saying, yes! We got a drawing over here that Ethan drew. It says, Arcade Warrior, Tater Tots are ready, with the logo right over there. That is awesome. And you got some pictures of me down here playing arcade games. Look at that. And the last thing from Ethan over here is, please autograph here, then send back. 
I will definitely autograph this piece of paper over here, dude, for you, and I will send it back. I'll also send you a signed arcade wear card back. Thank you so much for the letters and the drawings, Ethan. So this concludes today's episode of Warrior Fan Mail number six. Thanks to everybody who sent fan mail. I will try to get you guys back a signed arcade warrior card right over here, as long as I have your address. If I don't, um, I probably will not be able to get you um, a card back. Um, if you didn't give me your address, please um, send me a private message on YouTube or something like that, and um, we can work something out like that. Um, so in the future, though, everybody who sends me fan mail, um, if you want a signed card or a letter back, please, 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 um, make sure to give me your address. Just you're supposed, just have your address written on the top left-hand corner. You're supposed to do that anyways. I just want to make that clear for everybody who sends me mail in the future, so I'm able to send you guys something back because you know I really appreciate you know you guys sending me stuff. So in order for me to give back to you, you know I like to send you guys back something. You know whether it's a card or a letter or whatever. So just make sure to do that in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If any of my viewers want to send me anything, whether it's a letter, package, or drawing, you can send it to my PO box, which is Arcade Warrior. P.O. Box 342 North Charlotte 14514 United States of America. That will also be in the description of this video. So um, if you guys want to send me anything, you know, whether it's a letter pack or drawing, send it to that P.O. Box right there. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a like on the video. Also check out my links in the description of this video. Um, please add me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I post a lot of stuff on my social media. I'm pretty active on most of it. So if you have not followed me yet on any of my uh, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, social media sites, please do that. Also, check out my Arcade Wear shop, guys. I got a bunch of awesome merchandise on there, like t-shirts, phone cases, coffee mugs, and now I even sell pins. Not this exact pin, because this was a custom-made pin that someone sent me, but I have Arcade Wear pins with the awesome design on it. That's my newest thing in the shop, um, so go check that out. I'll also have some limited time only stuff coming up for Christmas, so be prepared for all that awesome stuff coming up in the future. If you want to check out my shop, I got a link to that in the description of this video as well. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll be seeing you in the next video. Until then, this has been Arcade Warrior, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.